Hello everyone, welcome to Kashiano Easy Math. We have here logarithmic exponential equation to solve. 5 raised to log of x minus log of 5 equals x. And we're looking for the value of x. And before we start, for those new to my channel, please don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. Thank you very much, I would appreciate it. Now let's start solving the exponential equation. 5 raised to log of x minus log of 5 equals x. So in solving the problem, we'll be using the common logarithm, the laws of common logarithm. So we're equating log on both sides of the equation. That is now log of 5 raised to the power log of x minus log of 5. That's to the base 5 equals log of x to the base 5. And from here, we're using the exponent rule. We have the exponent going down to the front as coefficient. That is uh, log of uh, b to the base a exponent x is equal to x log of b base a. So we're putting those uh, exponent to the uh, left side. That's coefficient. And now this becomes log of x minus log of 5 times the log of 5 to the base 5 equals log of x to the base 5. Here there's another log uh, formula to use that is log of a base a is equal to 1 since this uh, formula is simply written the same way as log of a divided by log of a. So log of a divided by log of a equals 1. So that will be on this side. So this now log of x minus log of 5 times 1 or log log of 5 base 5. That's 1. So times 1. Okay. Equals log of x base 5 and in here right side of the equation we have the uh, change of base formula the one of the rules formulas of the logarithm that is log of uh, b to the base a is equal to log of b divided by log of a so we'll be using this and that and the right side of the equation becomes now log of x divided by log of 5 and the left side of the equation is log of x minus log of 5 and from here we're gonna get rid of the uh, the uh, denominator that's log of 5 that means we're multiplying the whole equation by log of 5 alright so that's log of 5 so the equation now becomes log of x times log of 5 minus log of 5 times log of 5 that's equal to these cancels this is now log of x so from here simplifying the equation further we're moving at uh, transposing this log x this term to the left side and transposing this term to the right side so the equation now becomes log of x times log of 5 minus log of x equals log of 5 is square. Factoring this out and this becomes now log of x times the quantity log of 5 minus 1 equals log of 5 squared. Simplifying the equation further, we divide this by log of 5 minus 1. Same thing on the right side. So the equation now becomes log of x. This one is cancelled. And what we have left on the, on the left side is log of x. And we have on the right side log of uh, 5 squared divided by log of 5 minus 1. The right side of the equation now is... Uh, 
log of 5 squared divided by log of 5 minus 1. By using our calculator, the value of this log of 5 squared divided by log of 5 minus 1 is equal to negative 1.6229. That's the value of log of x. And another logarithmic uh, formula that is log of, uh, of a to base b equals to c. Then this can be transformed into exponential form. That is now b raised to c equals a. So we're using that on here. If you don't see the base uh, right here, it's automatic. That's base 10. So this now can be expressed as in exponential form. This is now 10 raised to negative 1.6229 equals x. And by using our calculator again, 10 raised to the negative 1.6229, that is now point zero two three eight. So that's the value of x. All right, or put x over here, either way. All right, so point zero two three eight. So that's the answer. And uh, if we were to check our answer. We have to substitute the value of x to the original equation. So let's do that. To check, uh, we're now having the original equation as 5 raised to the power of log x minus log of 5 equals x. Substituting the value of x. So this now 5 log of x minus log of 5, where x is 0 0.0238. The value of the exponent now is. 5 raised to negative 2.3224 is equal to x 0.0238. And solving this uh, left side of the equation further, 5 raised to the negative 2.3224, by using our calculator again, this comes out to so the question, by the way, is here, is this equal to that left or and right? Are these equal? So 5 raised to that negative exponent right there comes out to 0 0.0238. Really is equal to the right side of that equation. So this just confirms that the value of x, 0 0.0238, is correct. And so that's all for now. And uh, for those new to my channel, please don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. I would appreciate. Thank you. And you guys have a great day. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next videos. Bye.